how to make a hotel booking website with wordpress hi guys welcome back to another video and in this video i'm going to be telling you how you can make a hotel booking website with wordpress so having said that let's just jump into the video so first things first what we're gonna do is we're gonna come over here into the uh, plugin section over here and we're gonna go ahead and click on add new plugin and once we do that it's gonna take us over to the plugin store over here as you can see it has a bunch of different plugins that we can use and install and it can help us a lot so over here the first plugin that we're gonna install is going to be called Astra so just simply come over here into the search plugin section and search for Astra and once you do that as you can see this template this plugin will pop up and what you're going to do you're going to install this plugin and activate it and once it's activated you're good to go and the second plugin that we're going to install is called elementor so we'll, let me just search for elementor over here and once i search for it as you can see this is the uh, plugin right here and we're going to do the exact same thing click on install and activate now once that is done we are good to go and uh, let me just show you once it's done this is how it will look like in your plugin store over here is going to be your elementor plugin and then over here is going to be your astra starter template so what we're going to do is we're going to click on c library and it's going to take us over to the library where it has a bunch of different templates for us to choose from so over here we're just simply going to search for a booking and over here let's see if we have any hotel type of website let me just come over here at the top and search for a hotel and travel all right so as you can see we have a bunch of different templates but they're all pretty premium so we can't you know use it for free version so we have to buy them but there are some free ones such as this one like the mountains and the perfect hotel for mykonos you know i think this would look pretty nice so we'll just go ahead and try this one once we click on it all we have to do is you know let's just take a look at over here and as you can see it looks really really amazing so what now we'll do is we'll just come over here at the top and over here we can upload our logo if we want if we don't we can leave it as it is and click on skip and continue and then we have the uh theme of the overall website so as you can see if i click on the color of palais over here then the color overall changes and you can choose whichever one you want so right now i'm gonna leave it blank all right you can choose like red as well but i, I don't feel it so we're gonna leave it at the default one and then you have your fonts as well you can choose different fonts whichever one you think looks good go ahead with that and click on continue all right then what you're gonna do is you have your one last step just simply click on submit and build it's gonna delete your previously installed imported website website customize setting import widgets and stuff like that so just simply click on submit and build and just wait a couple of minutes for the website to be installed onto your wordpress site so i will catch you guys in a little bit once it's done okay so as you can see the website has been installed now we just simply click on view your website to see how it looks like and over here as you can see it looks pretty nice it looks pretty cool and you can go ahead and edit this website however you feel like it so since we installed the edit with elementor plugin we can go ahead and install it as well so it all depends on you so for example let's just assume that we have this website and we have you know edited to our desire so now what we'll do is we'll go back to the uh, dashboard all right over here click on dashboard and we'll go back and now what we will do is we can come over here at the uh, left side and you will see we don't have any plugins right now installed but you should but for now let's just say that we don't have it but now what you want to do is you want to go into plugins all right and you want to install a plugin called easy appointments here we go i have this one already installed so what you're going to do is you're going to install this and activate it and once it's installed and activated what you're going to do is you're going to come over here into easy appointments and you can use this plugin to you know confirm your bookings for your you know page so what we can do is we can you know go into the location section over here we need to add in a location for our hotel for our you know restaurant then in service we want to add a booking of the rooms you know and then for the employees you can leave that blank if you want to you know you can say like attendee you know and then for connections you can add like a connection like this whole person does this you know like this one is for the appointments so now what we can do is we can add another one this one was a simple one if you wanted to use this one another plugin that you can use is let's just go into the plugins over here and search for it if i search for booking right here as you can see we have booking package appointments all right salon booking system you know booking calendar and all of this so what we can do is let's just search for hotel booking all right as you can see this is a plugin that pops up wp hotel booking room so we're just gonna go ahead and install it and uh, activate it and 
there we go as you can see it's activated now let me just see where it is wp hotel bookings over here as you can see this is how it looks like so it should be over here on the uh, left side all right i don't see it i don't know why it should be over here but it's not so i guess we'll just try another one this one was not the uh, real one i guess all right so here we go i think this one is it let me see it actually all right so as you can see it was a over here if i come over here into the elementor section over here i should have integrations over here i need to have the api key okay so i reloaded the page and here we go so we have a bunch of different options now so as you can see we have branches over here we have exceptions over here we have services over here we have rooms over here so if i click on rooms all right it'll give us the options over here and we can go ahead and add another room all right so over here at the top we just add in the name of the room we add in the description all right and then over here we have some settings such as max people maximum room size you know color of it as well you know text preview branch over here quality and minimum booking day and then we add like a name and value over here and then we click on add customer and that's basically it so that's how this one works so this one is a little bit more uh you would say a little bit more detailed all right same goes with services so of course your hotel is going to have different services right so you can add different services over here such as a valet or a waiter or you know whatever you want and then you have exceptions over here and in exceptions you can add new exceptions like dates and days and then you have your branches so basically if you have different branches of your hotel you can add them over here so that whenever people come over to your uh, you know website to book they can see which branch they want they can choose a room they can choose the services they want and stuff like that so it's all pretty nice and really really amazing so at the bottom we have the booking plugin over here so as you can see it looks pretty nice and then you have your calendar view you have your new orders premium add-ons themes as well and payment settings as well if you want to you know add a payment settings over here you can add in the city tax value the vat number and the bank transfer message and click on save changes and that's basically it so these are all the things you needed to know about you know these plugins and how you can make a hotel booking website and also share this video with your friends and family members if they are you know trying to make a website for a different reason or if they're trying to make a website for you know a hotel or stuff like that or any booking services that they could use then they can use this method the exact same way so having said that that is it for this video guys and if you liked this video be sure to hit the like button subscribe to our channel and make sure to turn on your notification bell because if you do that not only will you be helping us out but you'll also be getting daily alerts of whenever we upload our videos we upload daily so you don't have to worry about running out of content so just make sure to hit the bell icon and uh, you'll be notified and you'll be able to consume your daily dose of tech videos and other gadgets and other tools that can help you run or scale your business so having said that i'll catch you guys in the next video and until then take care and goodbye